Hello, this is Mark McElroy. I'm at the Electric Cab Recording Studio in Portsmouth, New Hampshire, and I'm doing a video for Microphone Boutique. This is the Octava ML51. It's a short ribbon, ribbon microphone from Octava. This particular one has been modified, and I'll talk to you about the modifications. Uh, what this microphone is about, why is it good, why isn't it good, um, and uh, what to do to make it sound great. So firstly, uh, this was a really innovative microphone from Octava. Uh, this, it has a plastic body, so it, it looks a little cheap, but Octava, somewhere in the uh, late 70s, uh, got some plastic molding equipment and really enjoyed using it. So uh, it kind of looks like a Sennheiser, so the side address Sennheiser, except this is, I mean, front address, this is side address. It's a ribbon microphone, and if I hold it up to the light, you can kind of see the motor inside of it. Can you see that? There you go. So, um, this um, microphone also had a preamp, a pretty circuit board inside it, with a pretty complicated and so-so preamp. Um, and it took a battery, this weird shaped, weird battery, that um, is uh, hard to get. So. Uh, the great news is the preamp is no good, but the transformer in here is very good. Octava has always made great transformers. And so um, I opened it up, removed the preamp, threw it away, uh, wired the transformer directly to the ribbon motor, um, and it started sounding much better. It's, of course, very quiet. You have to use it with an additional preamp, something like a cloud lifter or something like that. But works great. It has this DIN connector, which actually has a plastic thread on it. You'll notice here I ended up putting on some electrical tape, just taping this DIN on, and just made a short XLR for it. Uh, that little plastic thing can get cross-threaded quite easily and cause problems. So, also there were some layers of protective... Um, diffuser in front of this for durability purposes. No ribbon mic maker wants their ribbon microphone to malfunction. So they all put some kind of stuff in the way. But they all virtually all sound better when you remove that. So there was a, a layer of wire mesh and a thing that looked like a cross over there I removed. So um, uh, there is one layer of something. Maybe I put a layer of silk something like that. Not as much protection as originally, but sounds much better without that diffuser in front of it. So, these can be gotten pretty inexpensively online. Um, with the modifications, they're excellent. They're excellent for overheads, for vocals, for all sorts of things. So, it's uh, worth keeping your eye out for. And, um, uh, while they're cheap, they look a little cheap, but they're not. Uh, Octava made great transformers, and a transformer is most of a ribbon microphone. So, um, it's a great deal. It's a great microphone. So, thanks uh, to you for watching, and I hope to do more of these videos for you on some great uh, microphones. Check out microphoneboutique.com. Check out the Electric Cave Recording Studio. Have a good one.